Before we proceed, please note that this video is made by AI, but all the content is manually researched by our team, and it's not AI generated. Ever found yourself in the midst of a heated battle in the post-apocalyptic world of Fallout 76, only to be rudely interrupted by an error code? An error code that reads 2-0-2-1517-43970, stating that authentication failed? Frustrating, isn't it? As per our research, this error mainly comes when there are some connection issues that can trigger for many different reasons, such as any internet issues, any connection interruptions, servers being down, any temporary glitches, etc. The first step to rectifying this error is to test your device's internet connection. If all applications requiring internet are having issues, disconnect your device from the internet and reconnect it. Should the problem persist, the next step is to power cycle your network and gaming device. This means shutting down your gaming device and internet connection, disconnecting them from the power source, and restarting them. If these steps don't resolve the issue, it's time to check the server status of Fallout 76 and your gaming console services. To do this, visit status.bethesda.net, where the server status of Fallout 76 and Bethesda Live services can be viewed. If these servers are functioning as expected, proceed to check your gaming console's live services status. Still facing the error? The final step is to check for any pending updates for the game or your gaming device's operating system. If there are any updates, install them and then check for the error again. In summary, to fix the Fallout 76 error code 2-0215174-3970, first, check your internet connection. If that doesn't work, power cycle your network and gaming device. Next, check the server status of Fallout 76 in your gaming console services. Finally, if all else fails, check for and install any pending updates for the game or your device's operating system. If you like this information, don't forget to subscribe. It will be a great support. And for more tech updates, visit queries.com.